look out there and see if I see one. There's a, a woman named Jasmine who's with the cross and crescent. Anybody? Jasmine? Look out. Ah, here she is. Thank you, Jasmine. Come on up front. This is a woman you want to know. Take a look at her. She's going to be one of our guys. <laughs>
for taking the time to join us today. This is your chance to learn about Islam and other faith traditions as we embark on this spiritual journey by walking together on a sacred ground. In Islam, the very meaning of peace is captured in its name. The root meaning salam or salam in Arabic means peace. The foundation of our religion is based on creating a relationship with God, whereby a person finds peace, salvation, and security. In an environment through submitting oneself to God, that is why followers of Islam are called Muslims, because it means one who submits himself to God and obeys Him. Since Islam means living in a peace, in a peaceful environment that emerged as a result of submission to God, the Quran asks that all humanity should embrace sil, that is peace, and reminds us to avoid following Satan. As stated in the verse, all you who believe, come in full submission to God, all of you, without allowing any discord among you due to worthy reasons, and do not follow in the footsteps of Satan, for indeed he is a manifest enemy to you, seeking to seduce you to rebel against God with glittering promises. Put on 208. Therefore, Satan is the true enemy of peace. Now I would like to share a little history about the sinner. Al-Aqsa Islamic Society has been active in promoting peace since it was established in 1991. When Al-Aqsa transformed this old furniture warehouse into Islamic Center, the area was a danger zone ridden with drug and crime, yet showing a constant presence with prayers held five times a day and becoming a strong community partner. It helped make this center a safe and desirable place to be in North Philadelphia. You can often see non-Muslim children from this neighborhood shooting hoops or playing in the playground because it is open to the entire community, not just members of the Aqsa or the mosque. During election season, our center is also becomes a polling station that many voters enjoy not because of the free refreshments, <laughs> but because they can find parking and a place to buy falafel sandwiches. <laughs> and even a playtime for the kids. However, one of the most rewarding efforts have been the interfaith events that have been brought people from all different faiths and backgrounds in a fun and creative way. We worked with more arts Art Well and the South Kensington NAC, among many other community groups, to transform this building into a work of art called Doorways to Peace. Currently, we are supposed we are supportive of the Out of American CBC, the one I worked at. Told you about right? <laughs> we are supportive of the Out of American CBC Tajdeed Housing Project, soon to be built on Calgary. Street that we will soon create affordable housing for all people in this.